Well, thanks for watching. This is day two of our Tesla solar install. And here's some pictures from day one. This day one was when they put up the solar panels on the roof, separate crew, took them all day, an eight kilowatt installation, 24 panels in total. At the end of the day, all the panels were on the roof, as well as one of the power walls. So what's happening today? Two electricians have come, they're installing the second power wall, and they're also installing all of the electrical equipment, which includes, as you can see here, relocating all of the existing loads into the new breaker box. So that's what those wires are coming out of the wall. That's all of our circuits from the house, AC, outlets, lighting, everything. And the breaker, the new breaker box, that's down the wall, it's up on the left there. So before I show you uh, everything completed, uh, just a reminder that if you haven't seen my first video, that shows the solar install. So now everything has been hooked up, the final installation has been done. We have our second power wall, which has been attached to the first one with uh, I don't know, some kind of mount. So it takes up less room. That's the inverter on top. Uh, the backup gateway is the box in white. That's the thing that switches between grid and battery. Uh, the, and the new load center is here. That box is just uh, passing cables through. Our old load center is on the breaker box is on the other side of the wall. So that's it. Um, before they left, they demonstrated um, that the app works, uh, that the batteries work as well. They simulated a grid outage too, um, but uh, <laughs> they have to leave it all disconnected. I'm in Nevada um, and you can't turn on uh, until permission to operate has been given by uh, the utility here. If we take a look outside, So this is the um, uh, this is the solar disconnect for the fire service to use. This is where the new meter will go for the solar only. Um, that's how they do it in Nevada. I don't think all states do it that way. Um, this is the main disconnect uh, too, and then the disconnect for the new load center inside is now here on the old panel. And all the old breakers have been removed and, uh, yeah, blanking plates put in place. So after a day's work, uh, we now have everything installed. Everything is hooked up. Um, the guys arrived uh, pretty early, I think just after 8 a.m. The power went off. Um, maybe about 9 a.m. The power went back on about 3 p.m. Uh, and the guys didn't actually leave until about five. So it was two guys for the whole day, basically. Um, that's it. Oh, there's a couple of things on the wall that are nothing to do with Tesla or the power walls. That is the transformer for the doorbell, and that is our landscape uh, irrigation. So now we just have to wait for uh, the utility to give us permission to operate. Well, it's now dark and uh, the lights are off in the garage, except a night light. And look, the bar walls have got these cool green lights on the side. It's a shame they're kind of hidden, but it's kind of cool. Nice little bonus there. So for video number three, um, come back and see the turn, day of turn on once we get our permission to operate. And instead of looking at a boring app like this, which shows that we're just pulling energy from the grid, we'll see energy coming from the solar going into the batteries and hopefully even some back to the grid. 
Thanks for watching. I hope you liked this. Um, if you did, please subscribe. Thank you.